Let's talk about arthritis. Arthritis can affect the temporal mandibular joints the same way it affects other joints. Osteoarthritis, the degenerative joint disease, is a type of arthritis in which the cartilage of the joints degenerates. Uh, it is most common in older people. The cartilage in the temporal mandibular joints isn't as strong as the cartilage in other joints. Because osteoarthritis occurs mainly when the disc is missing or has developed holes, the person feels a grating sensation in the joint when opening and closing the mouth. When osteoarthritis is severe, the top of the jawbone flattens out and the person can't open the mouth wide. The jaw may also be shifted toward the affected side, and the person may be unable to move it back. Even without treatment, most of the symptoms improve after a few years, probably because the band of tissue behind the disc becomes scarred and functions like the original disc. Rheumatoid arthritis affects the temporal mandibular joint in only about 17% of people with this type of arthritis. When rheumatoid arthritis is severe, especially in young people, the top of the jawbone may degenerate and shorten. This damage can lead to sudden misalignment of many or all of the upper and lower teeth, uh, malocclusion. If the damage is severe, the jawbone may eventually fuse to the skull, an uh, ankylosis, uh, greatly limited, limiting the body ability to open the mouth. So, uh, rheumatoid arthritis usually affects both temporal mandibular joints about equally, which is rarely the case in other types of temporal mandibular joint disorders. Arthritis is a temporal mandibular joint in a, in a uh, arthritis, uh, rather in a temporal mandibular temporal mandibular joint also may result from injury, uh, particularly injury that causes bleeding into the joint. Such injuries are fairly common in children who are struck on the side of the chin. So what's the treatment? Uh, a person with osteoarthritis is in a temporal mandibular joint needs to rest the jaw as much as possible. Use a splint or other device to control muscle tightness and take an analgesic for pain. The pain usually goes away in six months with or without treatment. Usually jaw movement is sufficient for normal activities though the jaw may not open as wide as it used to. Rheumatoid arthritis of the temporal mandibular joint is treated with the drugs used for rheumatoid arthritis of any joint. Uh, these may include analgesics, uh, cortic costeroids, uh, methotrexate, and gold compounds. Maintaining joint mobility and preventing ankylosis, uh, this is the fusion of the joint, are particularly important Usually the best way to accomplish these goals is by exercising under a physical therapist's direction to relieve symptoms, particularly muscle tightness. The person wears a splint at night that doesn't restrict jaw movement. If ankylosis um, freezes the jaw, the person may need surgery and in rate, uh, rare cases an artificial joint to restore jaw mobility. So thanks for watching and also listening to this video on arthritis. And uh, don't forget to check out the channel uh, for Medicine Boys. Thanks. See ya.